What it do, flight crew? FTC. Flight team stand up! We got the Golden State Warriors versus the Los Angeles Lakers. Game six, round two of the 2023 Western Conference Playoffs. Anxiety's all time high. All time high, all time, all time high. Now, Warriors, just like last game, bro, we don't need 70 points by Curry. We don't need 90 points by Curry. We just need everybody to come out and play, nigga. Come on. Please take this one. We go back home. Game seven, nigga. The Warriors. Steph, Chef, look at Curry, man. Clay Clay, Pole Party, Draymond Green Green, the other Green Green, Devin Chinzo, Moody Mooders, Kamunja, Looney Tunes, Aja Dollar, number 10, my assistant principal from seventh grade, number 40, Lamb Chops, GP2, Iggins Wiggins of Andrew, a couple of five or 10 day contract players, and I think we officially caught everybody in the Warriors lineup. Come on, man, we need a boost, we need a boost, we need a boost. Come on, Warriors, come on, Warriors. The Lakers. Welcome to Los Angeles. The AR. Have so many AD. Performances. And tonight, perhaps a Dennis fumbled the back. Scroto. Rui. Looney Walker. Zelo. Someone need to turn the car alarm off. You know what I'm saying? You can't be messing. Look at it! Check it out. Come on, man. Tunnel vision right now, man. Come on, Warriors. Not too far from y'all damn crib. About six hour drive. Wants to play with much more pace. It'll be interesting to see. Double team LeBron all game. I don't give a fuck. Double team LeBron all game. Thompson finds some room. Come on, can I make those in my sleep? Good shit, GP2. Clay's open. Bottom of the net. He was over three. Russell knocks that shut down. But Gary Payton the second. What is he, 6'3"? Let's go, Gary. Great pass from Draymond Damn. Green. Wait, wait, Wiggins right there. Nice, Wiggins. They said Wiggins was potentially supposed to be questionable because he had, like, some rib thing. Ah, I think you might have got cross all good. And then AD's good to see. Nice to see AD's out there, too. They didn't show it in the last reaction. We were trying to find the clips, but y'all was saying that apparently he got off in a wheelchair. But good thing he's uh he's healthy now. Come on, man. Y'all gotta guard that. Y'all gotta guard that. Y'all gotta guard that, bro. What's going on? What's going on? Wake up! It's game six. Wake up! Russell Reeves, corner three. It's Foul. Throws it up on the air, bounces No foul? Whatever, bro. Curry nice, Curry. To the rat. Call the foul. And one! That's a flagrant foul, high key, nigga. Curry gets past Davis. That's a flagrant foul, bro. This isn't football. A circus shot from Steph Curry. The Warriors are 111 from three to start the game. I would say 10 of them are good looks. And the corner like a prize to two. Let's go, Diva Chesso. Davis gets inside, flips it up. Come on, Looney Tunes. You gotta be a little bit more like aggressive. Like bump AD a little bit more. Curry was lost. Step back! His first three pointer, second field goal. Curry will bring it into the front court. Drives up All the way. Gets inside. All the way in one! LeBron, yo, Curry owns you, LeBron! Curry owns you! <laughs> yo, LeBron had like a 55-inch vert, bro. He couldn't still get that. Field goal. Curry will bring it into the front court. Dennis from the back. Scroll him. I know you hear me. Get off of Curry. Let's go. And all of a sudden, the Warriors got a 17-point lead. Bro, what's with the lazy passes, bro? Just the third pass. Turnover, but one more. One. There you go, Di Vincenzo. Take your time. Another one. Vincenzo, eight points off the bench. Pool blocked by Hachimura. Shot blocked by Green. Oh, good oh, defense, Green. Gets knocked down. Lakers want to increase the pace. James to Walker. Corner three. It's oh good. my gosh, bro. 
as Draymond Green backs it home. DiVincenzo gets to the rim. Nice! Aggressiveness! Slam that ball, LeBron. He mad. Full of glazers too. That was not even like like that was a nice move. I messed with AR. You guys know we messed with AR, but it's bro, it's against my team, of course. But bro, they act like Curry fell to the ground, bro. He this is really clamped defense. <laughs> What's with the oohs and eyes? He stayed on him and just got a lucky in one. He was right there. He didn't lose sight of him or anything. He just got a lucky in one. He almost airballed. Oh my gosh. They had like Curry fell three times. So play. James a three. Knocks it down. 13 first half points for James. Lakers back up by 10. There you go, Wiggins. Wiggins gets his first bucket. Nigga, that's your first bucket of the game? The commentator just said. Come on, Wiggins, tighten up. Don't fall for that weak ass pump fake. Oh my fucking gosh. Bro. Wiggins, I'll chill this out. Clay? Okay, Clay! No, yo, Clay's made some wild ass shots, bro. He's made some fadeaway 2K team shit. He's leaving wide open. Nice pass, Clay. There we go, Looney. Thompson catches, fires, airball defense. Demon Chisel got the rebound. Demon Chisel got the rebound. Let me chill out. Clay has actually been. He made some wild shots. I can't. Bro, bro, Clay, bro. You're a grown ass. Look, you, you got to hit the rim, please, bro. Please at least hit the rim. It's the playoffs. G Demon Chisel got. No, he, he got. Damn it, nigga. I thought he was going to make the layup. Nigga, airball the block. <laughs> okay, bro. <coughs> Got a hairball, my bad. Oh my fucking bro, oh my fucking gosh, my fucking tank top just ripped shit. Oh my gosh, no nigga. This gotta be a joke, nigga. Bro, is this the right video, bro? This gotta be in a regular season, bro. No, nigga, no, bro. What the fuck is this? What is this? Bro, this sequence was insane, bro. Thompson catches, fires. Airball, DiVincenzo blocked. Oh, my Davis. fucking gosh, bro. Final seconds, Reeves. It'll count if it goes. Did it count? Final seconds, Reeves. It'll count if it goes. Oh, he cuts it in. Get the rebound, please. Oh my fucking gosh, bro. Tighten up. Come on, Wiggins. And one, call the foul. Call the foul. Hey, Mike, well, Steve Kerr just told me we're fouling too much. We've got to keep them off the free throw line and convert. Russell connects. And one! Let's go! That's the momentum starter. That's the momentum starter. Drew extra help and then just zipped it to the corner. Drew it across the lane. Difficult shot. Oh, block that. Davis tips it off on Andy. 14 rebounds, 11 points for Anthony Davis. Curry. Don't be afraid to shoot. Green, left handed. Nice. Up and in. Nice. Davis leading the break the other way. Come on, James. Couple of stops. Down the lane, Bro, you, you let him walk into the paint. And again, Green gets it inside. Block no foul. James. Wiggins hasn't lost it. Schroeder racing up the floor to James. Up and in, off the glass. Timeout Warriors.
Reeves equaling the largest lead of the game. Shot clock at six. Reeves stumbles, gets to the lane, and backs it in. Largest lead of the game. 18 for Reeves. Curry. Nice, 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 nice. Thank you, Curry. Come on. Wake up, everybody. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Good rebounds. Let's go. There we go. One stop here. Stop jumping, nigga. Yo, no, no. Technical foul. He hung on the rim. Uh, bro, technical foul. He hung on the rim. And then he gets a free steal. Bro, Demon Chenzo, fuck. Nigga, nigga, nigga who, what team are you playing for? What team are you playing for? Why are you rushing? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, yo, you seen this shit? Yo, did you see this shit? Bro, bro, he just smacked Curry in the face and nothing called. Nothing called and gets smacked in the face, bro. Nah, bro, these refs are, bro, this is just completely rigged at five. Watch Curry with the ball. Look, look, look at Russell. Bro, you smacked the shit out of Curry, bro. This is a flagrant two foul. Toss this nigga out the game, bro. A 15-point Laker lead here in the third. Curry, floater in the first. Yo, position. Curry shreds it off. That's the number one players of all time, dude. Wants to quiet things down momentarily. Lonnie Walker's going to get more time. Shooter rejected. And Walker packs it over. Wait, what did they say? Going to get more time. Shooter rejected. Fumble the bat, Strodem ejected. Win. Quiet things down momentarily. Lonnie Walker's going to get more time. Shooter rejected. And Walker. Not my problem. Not my team. From Walker, he's got seven. He's probably clips or something. Lonnie Walker hits a three. Bro, not this shit again, man. Come on, bro. Guard this man, bro. Now Poole's got to get going. Right on cue. His first points in 12 minutes. He had four fouls. Bro, what did the commentator just say? Bro. Right on cue. Pool his first points in 12 minutes. He had four. They just said this is Pool's first points in 12 minutes. Four fouls in the first half. James he had four fouls in the first half? Terry dancing How do you get four fouls as a shooting guard? Bro, this James score is not Curry. looking right, man. Right I'm about to start screaming in a second, dude. Nice pull. Jordan Pool drives it. Reeves stumbles. Gets it out. Moody corner three. Got it. Nice. Get a stop. Jeez. Couple stops. That's all we need. Walker wide open. Puts it bro, do y'all just forget that Looney Walker is on the floor or something, bro? Looney Walker doing it again. Curry banks it in. Reeves. Oh, what a fake. Reeves. No way they're triple teaming Walker Austin Reeves. No way they're triple teaming Austin Reeves, bro. Draymond Green left open and answers. Nice. Final Quarter seconds, winding down. Cool, don't do nothing dumb. Pool there you go. Nice. Inside, Drive! Let's go! Let's go! Momentum! Pull out wide, okay! Yes! Yes! Play! Another terrific defensive play from the Lakers. James back Good defense, Wiggins. Wiggins. Cross the lane, lays it up and in. Wiggins to Curry. Oh, nice fake on Davis. Gets inside. Hits the bottom of the backboard. Wiggins. Bro, is this not a foul? Wiggins to Curry. Oh, nice fake on Bro, Anthony Davis literally jumped on top of Curry. Pause. Like, and put every part of weight on him, bro. Davis gets inside. Hits the bottom of the backboard. Wiggins saves it. Curry's got to get it off. Just what the fuck? Shot clock was winding down. He hits the rim. Thought he was make that shit. And Reeves comes away with a rebound. Oh, my gosh! Yo, these guys are trucking players! Down. He hits the rim. And Reeves Bro, Reeves just threw him on the ground. Get it off just does in time. Shot clock is winding down. He hits the rim. And Reeves comes away. And then the Anthony Davis stepped over him. Bro, yo, nah, man. I'm, bro, I'm, bro. The Lakers, man, y'all are extremely dirty ass team, bro. You guys are just, bro, have no class, no respect for the, like, NBA rule, like, Hitting code. <clears throat> like, bro, I can't even speak right now. I can't believe what I'm seeing, bro. You have a hella non calls. AD just walked over Iggy's like he's like lower than him or something. It, like, 
Reeves just threw him on the ground. Nothing was called, bro. There is no whistle in sight. Reeves ahead to Russell. Russell lays and then you have Russell cherry picking, bro. Like, play real basketball. Three pointer missed it. James snatches the rebound. Here he goes. James pass Hutchie Murray. Vincenzo trying to stay with him. Russell flips it up and in. Wade Thompson flips okay. it up. Vincenzo knocks down. Come that on, man. But it's still a 20 please, 20 please, 20. please, please, March something, drop. please. Charles I beg y'all, please. Lays in, lays it up and in. Back out Curry. Curry. Great shot. Good. Thompson to Looney. Looney gets inside, lays it up and in. There you go. Spark something. Couple of threes. Good double screens. Nice, Curry. Take your time. Pull up. Top of the key. Up top, James. Finds Reeves. That's off. Aspie. And such disappointment for the Golden State Warriors. New season will come to an end. What? Here in Los Angeles. Nigga, you hit it. That shit out, nigga. You spent 40 shit. No. No. Why are you smiling, Green? How can you smile? Damn, nigga, you was a glazing bitch. How can you smile? This nigga's blushing. How can you be smiling right now? How can you be smiling right now? No! No, this wasn't supposed to happen! No! Bro, this man Green is a dick sucking ass human, bro! This dude is smiling at the end of the game! Bro, we just lost! Shit, bro. This is not what I expected, bro. No, man. This is not what I expected, bro. No. No, man. This is not what I expected, bro. So, was that really it? That's the end of the season? Bro, we worked so hard, bro. That set, that game seven shit with the Kings. Bro, this was not supposed to happen. It was supposed to go to game seven. The dog, bro, the dog literally said game seven, bro. Curry had 32 points. Thank you, Mr. Number One Player of All Time. Number One Player right now in the face of basketball. Left it all out there on the court. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you for putting in the effort, bro. As rest of everybody on the team. Clay Thompson. You played every second sweat drop of the game and scored eight fucking points. They said there was a game six play. We scored eight fucking points. The highlights made it look like you dropped 35. You scored eight points. This is all you had to give? 
You scored eight points, bro. Like, you couldn't, bro, I, I'm getting that in the first quarter, bro. Three of 19, that's my typical IRL stat. Like, bro, how do you, bro, eight points? You couldn't, you couldn't give a better effort than eight points, bro. Eight points? Jordan Poole, I don't have any hope for you no more, brother. I bit my tongue multiple, multiple, multiple after multiple after multiple times throughout the NBA regular season and even in last year's playoffs. I don't have no more hope for you, Jordan Poole. I believe you should get traded as soon as this game ended, bro, whenever the game ended, bro. I, I hope your bags are already packed, brother. Appreciate the run you had with the Warriors, bro. At this point, you're literally robbing the whole Warriors franchise. Bro, Jordan Poole, you're getting paid more than the President of the United States. And this is all you had to give? Seven points? You had one zero-point game in one of the games? It's like... You can't even really even be mad all, like at all, bro. Because it just looked like from the outside looking in, except for maybe DiVincenzo. Like, it just looks like they just sat there and watched Curry just try to score and just try to carry them to, like, game seven and to the next round. Like, Clay, man to man, you scored only eight points in a crucial game six in, in the middle of 2023. How big social media is when it comes to sports. All you did is give in eight points. You scored only eight points. How do you go three of 19? How do the highlights make it look like you? The highlights, I bro, the, I, bro, I thought you scored like 35 plus. I think this, bro, the highlight gave you like an extra shot or something. What are the, bro, I swear, bro, I, Swear you hit like four or five jumpers in the game, bro. So you're telling me they had AI animated footage of you making fake jumpers, bro? Three of 19? This is all you got? This is all you can do? Wiggins! Fuck! Damn it, I didn't want to do it. I didn't want to go off you. Fuck. I didn't want to go off of Wiggins, man. I can't do it, man. I fucking can't do it. I can't do it, man. Wiggins. You score six points? Wiggins. Wiggins missed half the season. He had personal problems off the court. I'm restraining every will, power, and my ability and capability of a human being, Wiggins. Very grateful that you came out to play. I'm going to just humbly just pass and just not say anything about your stats. But thank you for coming. After that personal problem, pause before I said that. Thank you for returning back to the team. During those personal problems. But, bro, six points, bro. Bro, guys, look at this shit right here. I want y'all to notice this shit. Nobody in the starting lineup for the Warriors scored over 10 points. Okay, fine. Wiggs is injured, too. He had a broken rib. And then on top of that, he had personal problems. That's why I said I, said I humbly would pass. That's why I, I bit my tongue. I bit my tongue. Exclude Wiggins, bro, Clay, Pull. You can't really blame Green. This is just typical stats, bro. Looney Tunes had 18 rebounds. I fucked with that. Clay and Pull sold the game 100%. Not even you just sold the game. You sold the entire playoffs, bro. It just looked like from the outside looking in, y'all just sat back and wanted to see just Curry drop 50, 60 points, bro. Do all the work. Do all the... The, the just the, just a tough job, man. Like, like this is this is really disappointing way to go out in the end of the season, man. I did not expect for this to happen, bro. I really thought this was gonna be a double overtime game, maybe one overtime game, maybe a one two point differential. The Warriors win, and we have a game seven. It's really over. The season's really over, guys. Is this really it? 
This year's going by too fucking fast, bro. It's really it. This is not fair, bro. Now, another thing that you have to also put blame to, you have to also put a hella blame onto the NBA, bro. The NBA, I feel like, first of all, if you checked out the amount of free throws, after the last reaction, there was like an analyst that posted about like the free throw differential. The Lakers were shooting twice, maybe three times as many free throws the entire series. First of all, you could tell the rest was on the Lakers side, 100%. And not only that, Adam Silver needs to do a better job at giving professional athletes the proper fucking rest time. There should be no reason why we played an NBA professional playoff game. Two days, not even a full two days. It was 36 and a half hours, not a full two days. Right after a game seven, we are on the road or at home playing a playoff game round two with no break period. That has to be borderline illegal. Do you guys know any type of job that you work in America, you can only work a certain amount of hours a work week. You cannot, you, and especially you have to have a break too. You, you can only work a certain amount of hours with not having a break. So I feel like the NBA violated like the, like, like, like the workaholic break code. The Lakers ain't played beforehand like almost up to a month. Minimal like maybe three weeks if I'm stretching it too much, bro. So we have to put that to a factor. Why the hell did the Lakers get an extra rest period than the Warriors, bro? They need to do a better job at separating these, you know, playoff situation games and everything like that. So not only does everybody get well rested, every ba everybody's batteries are recharged, it also avoids injuries, bro. And then you have a high-paced competitive basketball, like, you know what I'm saying, game going on, bro. So all that I feel like is into factor, bro. Um, they need to do, like, like I said, bro, the NBA needs to do a better job of separating games. Like, we, there's no reason to hell after a game seven, crucial game seven, two days later, not even full two days later, we are playing in a round two game. Like, how is that even realistically, like, healthy and humanely possible, bro? Lakers box score, 80 got put on clamps. He played every minute of the game, 17 points, 20 rebounds. LeBron at 30, nine rebounds, nine assists. He's too lazy to get two or one more assist, one more rebound for a triple-double. Curry would have did it. Austin Reeves scored 23. Russell had 19. Walker had 13. I can't believe this is the end of the season, bro. This is not how I expected everything to end off, bro. I do give credit to Steve Kerr for playing the starters and not being like the rest of the teams. Like, we were reacted to the Phoenix Buns the last night. Um, and they, 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 they took out their starters like the last five minutes of the quarter. So, I mean, at least you can say that they didn't straight up give up. But at the same time, in a way, they kind of did because they kind of was relying on Curry too much, bro. Nobody in the starting lineup scored over 10 points except for Curry. Amazing, man. I can't believe it, man. You said they did take him out? The starter's out? Well, you know the NBA edits their shit <coughs> fast. It looked like they didn't. Well, never mind, Steve Kerr. I take that back. According to my chat, y'all, um, oh my gosh, bro, I can't even think straight, bro. This can't be fucking possible, bro. All right, man. Let's look at NBA chess clips. Let's look at as many interviews as we can. And definitely the interviews too. We need to see exactly like what the hell did he's except for Curry. Like what what does everybody else has to possibly say, bro? Like we we lost by like forty eight points.
Shout out to the subs and donors. Catches, fires. Right. Like Any bonus clips y'all request, let me know. Here's that Austin Reeves shot again. What did Dennis fumble the back scrotum get ejected for? We need to find that out. Davis, the rejection, and Reeves, the desperation launch. This man airballed, got packed. The NBA's best shot blocker. And then Reeves. Steve Kerr. LeBron has stepped that up as Lakers advance. Outside of the finals. As the Warriors will dribble it out. A dominant victory here in game six. The seventh seed is going to the Western Conference Finals. The Lakers hopes a banner number 18 still alive. <laughs> Shot of Ross. He's in the corner if you see him on the left side. Bro, Draymond Green, bro, just pack your bags and go to the LA, bro. At this point, to be honest with you. To be honest, bro. Bro, I definitely do not want to see Paul, bro, for the Warriors next season. I wouldn't be surprised if Draymond's gone. I'm already prepared for it. Are you playing a DBZ theme song in the background? Look at Curry, man, and LeBron. Who do you think they're talking about? We've had a lot of battles against each other. LeBron James will play in his 12th conference final. Perhaps his 11th NBA final. And perhaps his 5th NBA championship. Well, they've got a lot of work Calm down, down. comments say the Lakers are not going to the NBA finals, bro. <laughs> Relax. <laughs> Have to get by to get back to the finals. Damn, man, this sucks, bro. <sighs> All right, man, let's see what else is on free doctors. Let me look at that Dennis uh, situation. Is it at? Oh, I gotta type his name. There it is. Oh, here it is. House of Highlights. Got All right. So, apparently, fumbled the bag. Strudum got ejected. The highlights cut it out. We didn't. I don't think it was necessarily a flop, but I don't think it was a foul either. Whoa! Whoa! I don't think it was. They caught a foul on this? I don't think it was necessarily a flop, but I don't think it was. Bro! I don't think it was necessarily a flop. Because I'm listening to what the commentator's saying. Bro, this shit is rigged, bro. Bro, bro, pause everything right. Bro, this shit is rigged, bro. Bro, this was like a regular play. He lost his own balance. Nah, bro. This this game is this NBA. This man, this shit is different now, bro. Dude. I don't think it was necessarily a Bro, what drugs is this ref taking right here in the corner, bro? Look at his whole body demeanor. Bro, you didn't even give time to process. You just blew the whistle. Bro, this shit was rigged, bro. The Lakers did not deserve to win this at all, bro. The refs was on their side the whole time. The refs and the NBA was on their side, bro. Especially with not us getting the rep, proper rest period, bro. I don't want to fucking hear it, dude. I don't want to hear it, bro. When they're calling shit like this, I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now, bro. 
Bro, he just lost his balance. He didn't even, nothing happened. I don't think it was necessarily a flop, but I don't think it was a foul either. Wiggy just lost his balance. It's a regular inbounds foul. Oh, this is a turnover? <laughs> Bro got ejected with one point. And you get hit with your Where did he get his other tech foul. from? That's an automatic ejection. Darvin Ham not happy with John Goble. They're trying to say that Draymond Green put the ball in Schroeder's face. And he did. Bro, Dennis fumbled a back screw him. Bro, you get a Hall of Fame school threat bench, bro. What the fuck is he doing? Say that Draymond Look at this Green man right here. This is a grown ass man. If you can see like right under the rim. Yo, what what is he doing? You have like a million germs on the ball. He has straight forehead. <laughs> Bro, what the hell? And he did. Wow. Why was Schroeder? Why not a, not, not a double take? Bro, that's a technical. Bro, and then, bro, this should be delay of game too. Look at. And he did. He's holding the ball and preventing the game from going on, getting extra rest Schroeder? that the Lakers don't fucking need. This is crazy. Why this is crazy. Not a double did first. That's a bad call. Fumble the back, scroll on, get out of here. <laughs> that man had an early shower with one point. 1.7 turnovers, probably. Two texts. Three points, but five assists and good defense. He's done. Even right now, LeBron. Man, I can't believe our season's over with, bro. Oh, here's the interviews. They're coming in hot. Draymond Green reacts to the, oh, perfect. Get it nice and uh, raw, pause, because he used to be on the podcast first before he goes to anybody. What do you have to say about this, Draymond? Look at Area Other Players' interview. They got him. Draymond, Steve just said when he was looking around the locker room to come in here, he could just feel and see the fatigue and disappointment on your guys' face. Those are the two words he used. Would you agree that those are the overwhelming feelings right now, I guess? Definitely disappointed. Um... And I think, you know, just don't know how to feel. It's been a long time since we finished in May. Um, so just trying to process the feelings and, you know, move forward. But, you know, anytime you don't win a championship, it's a disappointment. Uh, for, for us, you know, a franchise who prides ourselves on trying to hang banners, you know. But at the end of the day, they were the better team uh, this series. And you got to give them their credit. Uh, they did the things that it took to win this series. So... Tip your hat to them, but it's definitely disappointing to finish. Be done now. It, this um, this wasn't just like kind of an abrupt, stunning playoff defeat. You guys obviously had a pretty bumpy season the whole way. Um, when you look back, bigger picture at the season, just you know, where did it kind of get off the tracks? You think? I think there were several things that went wrong uh, throughout the course of the season, and, and also just things that you can't prepare for. Like you know, it's hard to. Um, prepare for the things that happened in the beginning of the season and then bounce back from that. But we did. You know, it's hard to prepare for all the injuries that we dealt with throughout the season for, you know, missing wigs, uh, for the time that we missed wigs and, you know, all the things that's the going on. Over, bro. That, there's no excuses. Um, shit happens throughout every season. And, you know, if you win the championship, it's a battle cry. And it's like, yeah, man, we went through that. We went through this and we got through it. Um, if you lose, you don't, you know, you don't, go back and blame all of those things and say, oh man, this is the reason we lost. No, every season is made up of events. Some are great, some are not. Um, I think for this team, more of the events that aren't so great were so public. And you know, that's not something that you normally deal with. And so the world knows, uh, you know, the tough times that this team's had, but there's tough times you know, um, in every season, you know, winning a championship, there are tough times. I remember David West said something some years back, and everybody was like, whoa, like, <laughs> that's every year. Like, it's, it's Draymond, bro. Respect. I don't even know what you were talking about, bro. <laughs>
<laughs> like, I don't know if you're trying to save info for the podcast or what, bro, but I, I'm trying so hard to process something, and I can't be the only one, dude. What are you even talking about, dude? I cannot believe the fucking season's over with, bro. This truly sucks, dude. And then the fact the NBA season will start until October is like... Let me see if there's any other interviews. This is just all-time down bad feeling right now, man. All right, you have Steve Kerr. You have Reeves. All right, let's just check. Let's tap in two minutes each. Uh, first of all, I want to congratulate the Lakers. Um, they played a hell of a series. It's a great, great team. Um, I want to congratulate uh, Darvin and his staff. I thought they coached a, a brilliant series. Um, Darvin has done an amazing job this year. You know, in his rookie year as a coach, he's pretty much seen it all. And I also just noticed Kamunja. I don't even think checked into the game at all, bro. Hey, man, I wouldn't be surprised if Kamuja want to leave, bro. I don't blame him. But just the amount of disrespect. Like, you have Moody and Moody's playing, who's a nice, consistent casual, but you don't have Moonja playing. You didn't take advantage. Like, Moonja is an extra athleticism, like, role player, bro. He could have clamped AD up. He could have been, like, getting a couple of, like, blocks on LeBron when he's driving inside. And, um, Pick and roll offense. You know, you can see his poise and um, just his his nature on the sidelines. How important that's been for their team, given everything that, that um, they've been through to get to this point. And uh, so, congrats to again to to Darvin and the staff and uh, and their team. Of course, LeBron and um, AD are um, just brilliant players. Uh, they control the series. Uh, Shout out subs and donos. You know, I thought we had our chances. Um, to me, the series came down to games one and four, um, and the Lakers outplayed us in the key stretches of those games. You know, down down the stretch, and that's that's really the difference. But uh, the better team won. So, uh, congrats to them. And um, <sighs> sit up tall. See you, Reeves. A minute or two minutes, man. That's going to cap it off, bro. Quick, quick one before the real question. Did you know the 50-plus footer was good right away? It felt good. Uh, you know, you don't make many of those, but it did feel good when I shot it. All right, hey, man. Credits to Reeves, up. man. Just kind of the Reeves going to get a nice big contract at the end of the season. He might even be an all-star next year. Rise, Austin, these last few years, and like this year postseason now, to be playing almost 40 minutes, you know, relied upon to this degree. Um, as an integral part of the team in a game six setting against Golden State, LeBron, AD, Steph, Draymond, Clay, the whole thing. I, I, how would you describe uh, what it's been like for you? Oh, man, this was special. Uh, I got a text from one of my really good friends before the series started, right when we won uh, last series against Memphis. And he was just like, no pressure, but, you know, you're, you're about to be in one of the, the most, you know, the biggest rivalry of like my life, you know, ever since I think 2015, they've been just battling it out, Brian, Steph, and then their whole core. Um, so it's special to, you know, get that win uh, and to beat a team that's, you know, so established, so good that uh, they've won four rings in the past 10 years or whatever. So it just is great. Um, also, I had my brother here, he flew in from Germany. So it was just a special moment for me. Austin, uh, you guys, I guess your only NBA experience is being a teammate of LeBron James's, but uh, do you feel like playing on his team and going through a regular season where your team is scrutinized and, and there's a regular season game has more intensity than maybe the average NBA team might have can make a group prepared for the intensity that comes in the playoffs? Yeah, for sure. Uh, started off 2-10. Um was was not fun and when you're in an organization like this you're expected to win and rightfully so um but like you said being i feel like until the playoffs the, the month i can't believe previous, this is done, the, 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 i can't believe this is it man cash is tweet
Man, dude, people are on my nuts in my mentions, bro. Oh my gosh. Look at these fake Laker fans, bro. <laughs> my goodness. I was praying on their downfall today, flight. All right, looking on Cash's Twitter, I want you guys to recognize that this is a grown man. He'd still be alive right now if you ain't gas him up. Tweeting dirt lyrics. Okay, shout out to dirt. It solidifies LeBron's greatness as the GOAT. Appreciate it while he's still here. Like, I, I, I just want you guys to know that, like, we are we going to sit up here and really act like, like the Lakers don't have seven All-Stars, bro? Like, bro, if LeBron only had 80, they wouldn't even made the plane. Like, bro, you have, obviously, LeBron and 80, two All-Stars right there. AR is now an All-Star. Looney Walker's low-key an All-Star, kind of. The Rui dude is an All-Star low-key. And then you have D-Lo, that's an All-Star. That's six. And then they had Westbrook, but they got rid of him. So really, realistically, bro, they got six all. They got a stacked ass team, bro. <laughs> like, what? What? What exactly? Like, dude, man. Can't believe this it, man. This is really it. There's not a bonus game like a game six point five, then seven. If we win that, this is it, man. Well, <coughs> but I will say, despite the disappointing ass loss, despite. The disappointing end to the season. Thank you, Golden State Warriors, for an entertaining 2023 regular season to the postseason. Really wish this outcome would have been a little bit better. This is not what I expected at all. Um, we'll be in the finals next year. Easily. Guys, don't remember, we lost to the Cavaliers. You know what I'm saying? During that time when they came back 3-1, obviously it wasn't the same situation. The next year, right after that, a couple of years even, we got two more rings. So, this is going to be a great minor setback for a great comeback, man. Next season, we're probably going to win about 70-plus games. It's going to be a real fun NBA season. On top of that, we're getting extra rest. You think about it this entire NBA season, we didn't get a rest from the start of the NBA season. This is what I'm telling you guys, talking about going right back to the NBA separating a lot or, 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 or like giving a break and gap period bro like you know the finals ended i believe like the end of june i want to say last year something like that two more months later or not even like bro honestly maybe a month and a half you have the warriors summer league which technically everybody got to come out pay attention so your mind's already set on basketball like, bro, it's not, like, you got people in the chat saying I'm making excuses, but you're not even hearing me out. We had, like, literally no proper, like, break, bro. Like, we're not robots. You know, so I just hope the NBA takes stuff like this into consideration. But next season, man, we're coming back stronger, man. I have a lot of faith. Uh, I feel like we're going to make a lot of huge roster changes. I feel like it starts out with Jordan Poole. Jordan Poole, whatever trade value we need or he, or he has... They need to let him go. You know what I'm saying? Um, I honestly feel like I can see a Kunkpo coming to the Warriors. Call me crazy, but I can possibly see that happening. And it was talked about, I feel like it was a rumor about that couple of years back. So I feel like the Warriors make a proper move on getting a Kunkpo. You know what I'm saying? They can shop around maybe Draymond, Jordan Poole. They might possibly, I hope they don't, low-key. They might have to give up play. But, bro, I think the Warriors, if I'm the Warriors personally, they need to get an all-star, superstar power forward. You know, some someone like an Akunpo, and Bita Joel. Um, shit, even, um, hate to even admit his name, Randall LeJohn or somebody like that. 
you know, like somebody like a power forward, a dominant power forward. And as long as we can probably possibly keep play, 70 plus win season, man. But Golden State Warriors, thank you for a very, very entertaining season. I think I reacted to just about every Warriors game, which was the goal. And on top of the postseason and everything like that, Golden State Warriors. I will see y'all next season. Oh, and even Zeon, too. No matter fact, bro, I would make a move on Zeon right this second, bro. You hear me right now, Warriors? I'm making a move on Zeon right this second, bro. Trade Jordan Poole, Draymond Green, four or five draft picks. Get Zeon, bro. It's over with. But anyway, man, go to State Warriors. Thank you for an entertaining year, man. See you next season.